<laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Skyrim. Uh, the Master Chief Collection, I'm Greg. And I'm Philip. We just kicked the shit out of the story, and now this is like a cleanup episode. That is really pretty. That is nice. It's like we fast traveled into the beautiful night sky mod. No nah, man, the night sky mod is just. Sorry, don't mean to plug someone else, but jam. Like that beautiful night sky mod just like opens this up. Cause it looks like the Aurora Borealis. Yeah. But it's not necessarily meant to be that. That looks like a heavy armor helmet. What do you think? I think it would be really cool if um Look, like that definitely looks like it's supposed to be a in constellation. The, in the enhanced night skies you could see the constellations. That would be fucking amazing. What do you think that's supposed to be? I don't know if it's supposed to be anything. <laughs> well, what do you think it is? That's what constellations are. Is what do you think they're supposed to be? <laughs> hey, handsome. Oh. Let's go see what's up with our companion boys. It's been yeah. Let's it's been let's be months. their harbinger for a hot second. <laughs> we kind of well, like, hey guys, sorry. We we just walk in here and fucking everything's like trash, and they're just like. Our leader's been gone for fucking Six or 15 seven bajillion days. years. <laughs> it's the fifth era now. I have no idea who you people are. Let's see if we can find uh, our GB. That's Vilkas. Isn't he armor? To be the Two hand. Two hand. Let's just uh, <laughs> let's just wait till the morning and see if he's outside training. I'm committed. Two. Waiting. <laughs> oh, there's Ayla. She trains in archery, yes. Yes. I've heard some rumors about the Vignar. Is it not allowed? A back trainer? It's not exactly forbidden. Or to everyone else who's in here except for him. Because he's a fucking annoying little bitch. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I love you, Ice Brain. You Vilkas said There he is. I don't know what that means. Oi, buddy. You seem honorable, so that's good. My sweetheart, yes. I'll show you what I can about protecting yourself. And dealing some damage. And I think we're almost there. Two. So we're there. Now we just need the actual level up mm -hmm. to get there. So what we're gonna do... Is we're gonna finish some more training. This big sensual you know, beast right here. Kodlek's funeral. The Skyforge feels more awake. It's always been said that the souls of the heroes of old are what gives Skyforge cool. steel its strength. But I think the Forge knows the greatness of Kodlak's soul. I can't really explain, but it feels like it's young. I'll wager it could now forge metal the likes of which hasn't been seen since eras long forgotten. I'm eager to try. Yeah, they're like, ah. Oh. I'll show you what I can. Show you what I can. We just absolutely annihilated our funds. Ah. Oh. oh, we're edging so hard. And we're off to visit the restoration lady. I was going for, like, uh, the wizard. Yeah. The wonderful wizard of Winterhold. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Except that she actually has a name. And she has a complex about her fucking magic. Which is so sad. It's like, restoration is valid school of magic. Right? And it is. It totally is! Like... We got challenged as a mage. It would be... that shit? Yeah, it would be the mo... Yeah, we should tell her about that and be like... You... We heard you are a great mage. With hammer in hand. No. Well, I challenge you to a duel. No. Well, too bad. I'm challenging you anyway. I, mean, just... <laughs> I will not take no for an answer. And then literally <laughs> half the town just decided to gank his ass. Do, do you... Oh, that's her. I think that's her. I was... She always said, where's white? That might be her. No, that's senpai. Problems, let me know. It's my job to keep things running smoothly. Or kind of learn their spells. Well, She's the hall monitor. <laughs> that's really all she does. 
and offers training in that school. You hearing that too? Finis is one of I saw that too. What's, what's happening? What's, what's happening? For fuck's sakes. Do you just... You, you're... You're literally attacking the worst place you possibly could. Like, yeah, this is the the one fortress. Oh my oh god. god, he's a nice dragon. He's a frost dragon. Oh, oh, oh! Make sure you don't aggro anybody else here. Yeah, I accidentally clock someone. Yeah. It's the most valid form of magic. Oh, you're a dick. He's gonna get like timmed down by everything. <laughs> so somebody just fucking summoned a flaming generic on his ass. Who's mirror bells? Yeah. Nice. Is, is he gonna plummet right here? And are, are they gonna have a new thing in the courtyard? Yup. Oh my god, his ass just exploded. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, have you ever had that happen before? Once, and he just stayed there forever. What a monument. <laughs> like, yeah, nice lawn decoration, bro. Day-to-day -day operations are my responsibility. Day-to-day -day operations, you say? <laughs> <laughs> I make sure everything stays in order here. <laughs> fucking sums a flame agent and aren't gonna fuck a frost dragon. <laughs> it's a stray dragon. Okay, what time is it? 10 p.m.? Yeah, everyone's probably trying to go to sleep. And then goes back to normal. <laughs> Just... That is awesome. Did anyone else run out? Are people like talking about it? Like, what the fuck was that? It's That's the mage. illusion ma mage, I think. One of them is. Of I don't remember. You want to work on something that's not officially allowed? Don't tell anyone. You. You, you can see me. This is the illusion mage. Uh, no, I can't. See. What? <laughs> oh God. It's like when you lied to Lars about casting invisibility on him. <laughs> I think fake invisibility is probably the best spell that's out there. And then that dude comes and is like, Can you see me? <laughs> no, I can So is, is invisibility actually a fucking illusion spell? Yes, 100%. What the fuck? <laughs> Who are you? I care little for idle conversation. That's a conjuration. Venus. Venus Gester. <laughs> Uh, anybody eating some bread? Anybody? You wait and hear the the clicking for some reason. The clicking. There are few places where one can pursue my type of work without fear of persecution. He's a sleep talker. Dude, do you think he like conjured a little mouth to talk for him? <laughs> just just on the side of his head. Sleeping. There she is. No, that's destruction. Yes, that is destruction, lady. Do do ba do do. Of course, our lady is off uh, freaking trying to push her magic on someone in person. <laughs> Just peddling some I hear, What? I heard a female's voice. It's probably her. Arcane Enchanter. Alchemy. Don't touch that. Don't touch that. Don't ever touch that. That's a quest item, and it'll get stuck in your inventory. Forever? Forever. Until you get the quest, but the quest is glitched. There you go. Fun fact! <laughs> Ah, call that. Right. Restoration is a perfectly valid school of magic, and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. So you're treated badly because you suck? No, not really. <laughs> not directly, I mean. But I know things are being said behind my back. Conversations cease when I enter rooms. I'm quite aware of what's going on here, and I will not stand for it. Good. Spells and incantations for those with a talent to cast them. Of course I've got the talent to cast them. Are you fucking daft, woman? <laughs> Close what? wounds. Oh, jeez. So that's like... I think that's the next step up. Uh, you'll other... Turn undead. Stop. Dead fast ward. <laughs> I totally forgot that wards and turning undead was in the resto tree. That just makes me hurt. I thought, yeah, I thought wards were an alteration. No. <laughs> it just makes me hurt. <laughs> All right, we're we're gonna we're gonna buy close wounds. <laughs> does that make you? Uh, does that make you uh, want to talk behind your back about uh, fucking resto? Because <laughs> the ward. Yeah, oh yeah, a little bit. Okay. You didn't learn anything from her. Oh, are you going to read the spell to him? Yeah, I got to jam it over. into my fucking face. Boom. Close wounds. 
or close wounds. Oh my god, we're edging harder than anything else. Yeah, we're, this is bullshit. Let's just equip this real fast. Let's see how fast it heals. See him. Ooh, that takes a lot of magic. But like one of those heals like almost all our health. Yeah, that heals like twice as much. <laughs> One sixty-five. So now we got a fast healing. We don't need unfavorite. Unfavorite. Let's yeah, almost just... exactly twice as much. A little oh. bit more. Okay. Favorite. I will know. Fast healing only heals so little because it's uh, it's quick. Right. Well, it's the same kind of spell. Yeah. This is just the next upgrade to it. That's the add up version. That was the. Uh, um, like you can see. See in the corner? It says yeah. level, add up. That was the apprentice level. This is gotcha. the novice one. This one's the one you hold. Uh, that one's the one that goes flick. And this one's another flick that does for. You know, per second. Not undead or Atronox. Turn undead! <laughs> the add up level. Cool. So now we should just like 165 that is skills that is half our health <laughs> yeah so one of those is half our health that's good what are we gonna do to get that level oh we're gonna do alchemy <laughs> <laughs> let's uh let's make some cure disease potions I guess why the fuck not nailed it what about fortify restoration? No. <laughs> stamina, you mean? Yeah, that too. Fortify stamina. That's literally doing like nothing. <laughs> okay, we did some alchemy. That was. Aren't we edging right on something so hard? We probably are. On a skill. Yeah, resto. And smithing. And smithing? Yeah, we're, like, we're pretty close on smithing. Yeah, we're edging on resto. Yeah. Hmm. Train me, lady. Or we can just start walking towards the quest. <laughs> Become ethereal and jump out the college and go see Septimus. Unless we don't need to go see Septimus because we're going to see him later anyway. No, we need to go see when Septimus. When we go get to Ogma Infinium. What's this? The Midden? The hell's under the floorboards? Let's find out. Let's find out. It's like a it's like prison. The, it's like the rat way. It's, ah, oh, shit. My brain's failing me. I can't remember what they call the, uh, the dungeon in the Eerie right now. I don't even know what that means. From Game of Thrones. Well, exactly why. Probably the Sky Dungeon or something stupid like that. Oh, but. the one that's on the wall? Yeah, no... I don't remember what those ones are called either. I gotta brush up on my Game of Thrones. Uh, oh shit. Hurt me. Hurt me. Hurt me like you love me. We're, oh, we're, we're still locked onto that Draugr. This Ice Wraith is doing literally so little, but like... He's doing okay. This is the most grinding ass grinding we've done in a while. <laughs> yeah, just, let's go down into a basement and get a fucking little ice wraith to fuck us up. Heavy armor increased! Uh, oh, uh, yes! And restoration increased! <laughs> oh, yeah! Get you on! <laughs> it's when it rains, it pours. Uh, okay, let's see. Let's go for. Oh, uh, god, I don't know. Been a while. And it's time. And then we gotta put it in resto, right? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Smithing? No. Oh, okay. <gasps> Excuse you. Man, we are behind on that perk. <laughs> but we're ahead on conditioning. Oh man, there's so many heavy armor perks we can get. We could we should be taking like no damage right now. <laughs> like we're almost we're one behind Dude, on that. Did you see that ice wraith? No. <laughs> we'll see what our carrying capacity is. Oh, 190. <laughs> so we just got a perk that lets us torch back. Uh, it makes our heavy armor weigh nothing. So, yay! What the 
fuck. Oh, this is the broom closet. Okay. It's a conjuration thing that you have to... That's a fucking... <laughs> it looks like you're getting ready to summon something from fucking a plane of oblivion. <laughs> you do. In, in the broom closet. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a dude sitting there with a book. Yeah, I, I kind of mistook that for a dude in a cloak, too. Yeah. Uh, I like where you're going with that. So this thing... <clears throat> if you're good at conjuration, this thing... You need, like, Daedra hearts, ebony ingots, and, like, brooms, I believe. And you can make, like... You also have to do the master level uh, quest for conjuration. Did you know that there are master level quests for each conjure or for each magic teacher? Really? Yeah. So if you reach, uh, I believe it's ninety, you can talk to them and be like, "I've learned all I need to know. What next?" And they'll be, they'll give you like a secret special uh, quest. So like for that one, it's to for conjuration, it's to retrieve an orb that you can place on the pedestal and you put those ingredients in there and it'll summon up fully leveled or uh, like 100% fully maxed out level uh, enchanted daedric armor so like the Whoa. highest so like the highest amount you can get on that armor Ow. fuck so like you can get like uh gloves that give you plus 40% to two-handed and stuff like that and like like the full set like anything you want out of the danger set that's kind of cool it is thing is if you're practicing restoration or not restoration conjuration you're probably not going to be spec'd out in heavy armor and if you are well you're a badass <laughs> and you're set can it get light armor no just the danger set Fair. Because you're literally summoning it from Oblivion. That's cool, though. It is. It's super cool. And it, that's the only way to get that armor? Like, armor that high? Uh, no, it comes in chests, too, but, like, you're guaranteed that armor that way. That is creepy. Little Daedric we'll gauntlet to, there, too. You want us to take all the fingers. No, just activate it. Oh, God, it's like the Elder Scroll all over again. <laughs> Ow, what's hitting me? Oh, I just rolled my ankle. On a rib cage. On a rib cage, yes. Do you hear a skeleton? I do. What was that? Creepy cluster. Nice. It's your teeth. So this is another <laughs> random quest. You There's five rings hidden all over Skyrim, and if you find them, place them in the correct spot, you will be able to summon... You'll get a spell that lets you be able to summon a... Uh, found him. <laughs> a merchant. A Daedric merchant. Oh, weird. Do you just buy Daedric hearts from him? You can buy... What the fuck? There's a whole lot of boys down here. Yeah. We fell into the friggin' death, like the Lazarus pit. Jeez. Ooh, sweet roll. Oh, cool. Alchemy. Yay. That's just what we needed. <laughs> I getting... can't wait until we're power leveling alchemy. I'll be honest. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> that's that's skin. getting went now. that way, I think. I'll be honest. I'm kind of lost. Oh, poor little deer got lost too. Oh, what? No. Oh shit! You can't even lock pick that. So well, obviously we hadn't gone that way, and we must have gone the way that I. Oh wait. Yeah, this place is confusing. Went through the. Oh door. yeah, you fell. That's why this was so familiar. Now I have to go back up again. <laughs> Fucking right we do. I really wanted that chest. No, we went through that way. We go this way now. To Skyrim. That works. Okay. Now where the fuck are we? We're, 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 we're underneath the college somewhere. 
<laughs> I guess so. Become a thrill. <laughs> no, it's just fast travel to Septimus Outpost. Yes. No, it's these Grimmers too. Where's that post? Right up, up. Up. The cave. <laughs> Does it fast travel us inside? No. No, of course not. Now we gotta go inside the grate. The very shitty door. No offense. <laughs> I mean, it's an outpost. I mean, it's a fucking ice cave with a box inside. <laughs> yeah, it's like he used friggin'... Fuck. Put it away. I unscribed the lexicon. That's what she said. <laughs> he just like grabs it just like so fast. <laughs> He's just like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> Jeez, Rick. Can loose the hooks, but none alive remain to bear it. A panoply of their brethren could gather to form a okay. trick. Something they did not anticipate. No, not even them. The blood of Altmer, Bosmer. Oh shit, Thunder, so you have to do that story quest. You have to go through Blackridge and all that to get the fucking blood extractor. Wow. It will drink the fresh blood of elves. Come when its set is complete. Harvest everything. Yeah. So let's get his blood. <laughs> He's not an elf. <laughs> that looks very welcoming. So tentacly. Speak with Wretched Abyss. <laughs> Come closer, bashed in my presence. Um. I am Hermaeus Mora. I am the guardian of the unseen and no Yes, sometimes you can see eyeballs. I yep. have been watching you. A lot of the time you can see. I would. I would assume. You've been watching with your many eyes. Fucking nerd. Daedra of knowledge. That's to forbidden to him to. Him All knowledge. All knowledge. So of course everyone would go to him for the forbidden. Is its end. This isn't the last time we see him. He's a key player in one of the DLCs. It's his realm. Yeah. That's so sad. He's like, kill the poor crazy guy who's probably been turned crazy by him. What say you? What say I? I'm a servant, my lord. Oh, God. Speak with me when the box has been opened and all shall be revealed. So that, oh, that's the exit. So yeah. he's, he seals you in here when uh, you pick up the extractor. Yeah, because he knows where the exit is. Because he's the knower of the unknown. But if you don't know, now you know. Where is the, where we need to so go? So we got another day to quest open. Yeah, we do. How many of those do we have going right now? One. One. <laughs> I mean... Uh, yeah, we need to find the dog outside Falk Reef. That's part of a danger that's quest. That's one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we never did find that's Leafner's one. family. Ah, fuck him. That's Dark Brotherhood. Yeah, we've got three in our inventory that we could do. So yeah, I guess we'll uh, end it right here. And yeah. Thanks everybody for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that good shit. We'll see you next time. Bye!